All right, we're guys, we're back in the Valley of Bowser 2. So let's start. I highly recommend having a cape here because I will be doing the... Wait, this isn't the one I'm thinking of. Oh, uh, uh so, well, okay, I won't need a cape in this one. <laughs> I was thinking of, whoa, 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 attacking shell. <laughs> that shell is an evil shell, I tell you. Directly homes in for Mario's uh, uh, carbon monoxide. Ow, oh, breath. <laughs> Uh, I'm kind of playing stupid today, aren't I? Yeah, I should play a lot more careful. I gotta realize that we are now in the final world of the game. Well, actually, it's not the final world, but it's still getting pretty tough, so... Yeah, I should be more careful. <laughs> um... I recommend being small here, but unfortunately I am big. So, it looks like I'll have no choice but to do this as Big Mario. Yeah, the object of this area right here is to carefully navigate through this maze without getting squished. Of course, the safe spots are in these little crevices at the tops and bottoms of the screens. And when you're big, you often have to slide run to those places because there's just barely enough time for you to do so. So, yeah, if you're a small Mario, you'll have a much easier time doing this than I am with the regular Mario. But, don't get me wrong, it's, it's you can do it either way, so don't worry. And oh yeah, also watch out for dead ends. Dead ends are definitely killers in this area. But uh, you can usually see a dead end as it's coming. Whoa! <laughs> so you can prepare for it, but other times you can't. So be very, very cautious. Yeah, I just went down that little path over there just to kind of get a look ahead of what I'm going to have to run towards. That's another good plan that you can do is just use the stop points to get to run ahead. I think this is safe to go. Yes, it is. Oh my god. <laughs> OMG. That was a little bit ugly there. Okay, we made it. Don't worry, we made it. Okay, run, 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 it's going to squish you. Run, 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 run. I'm going to do the secret exit first. So stand right here, and it'll pull you up right there or push you up there. Yes, this is the pathway to the secret exit. Look at that. Who would have thought of that? That had me stumped for hours upon hours. Well, that takes care of Valley of Bowser 2's secret exit that leads to the fortress. But I'm going to go and do the regular exit before I do anything else. So let's go back to Slow Town. And yeah! <laughs> it is really, really slow in this level. Mainly because of these Layer 2, uh, I don't know. Looks like, I'll, I'll call them cheese, just because there's so much food in this, in this game. You know, everything's named after food. So I'll just call these very big cheese platforms. I, I got hit by that same bat twice. <laughs> that was just mean. Okay, and let's go. It looks like we're nearing the end here. I think there's the feather. Oh, wait, no, it's a mushroom. The feather's in the box up ahead. <clears throat> And I, uh, I'm definitely going to power... Wait, what? Oh, there we go. <laughs> There's a feather up here. There we go. I'm happy now. Those are wings for Yoshi. If you have a Yoshi, you can just skip past this portion, of course. Yoshis are quite a happy little dinosaur in that regard. But otherwise, they make you so big that you take a lot of hits. <laughs> Because uh, I believe you are three squares in height instead of the two squares that you are in, as Mario. So, yeah, Yoshi can sometimes be a hindrance and get you killed down like bottomless pits or something like that. But most of the time he's a helpful little dinosaur or dragon, whatever he is. <laughs> it's a debater one. <laughs> and carefully navigating it once again through the slow corridors of death. And run, 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 run. <laughs> this, it, this area really, really is a nerve-wracking area. If you don't know what you're doing, and uh, I don't entirely know it, <laughs> what I'm doing because I'm not a Mario expert, but I seem to be executing this well. Knock on wood, but I have both hands on the controller, so I can't. <laughs> so you know how this is gonna go. I'll probably get squished and then swear a bit. <laughs> And we're waiting. Oh, shoot. I prepared too early. I was going to push myself against the wall to get as far away from it as I could. You know what? I'm going to do the fortress. I'm ticked off. I'll see you guys back when I pass that other part in the next part. <laughs> 
son of a bitch. <laughs> it's just so slow. I just, it's just not fun to do multiple times. <laughs> anyway, the regular exit in that other one is, uh, past that secret exit area where I had to go downward, I mean, <laughs> upwards over the ceiling. I wonder if that's like a reference. Whoa, 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 that thing went really fast. <laughs> Usually they have a little preparation time. I'm not used to that. And, uh, yeah, I guess these are a lot faster than usual. So jump, 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 avoid the death. Okay. <laughs> And it looks like there's a power-up for me waiting happily. Woohoo! I'm a poet and don't know it. <laughs> and we're going down. And hit that. Doesn't have to hit that. Whoa, these are going fast. I'm not liking this. Can these squish you? I'm pretty sure they can squish you. Oh, bu -bu -bu. <laughs> yeah! Ah, yes they can. <laughs> this is not a good part, I tell you. Let's try that again. Hopefully we'll have more luck. We are making zero progress. <laughs> Okay, and look out for Mega Spikes. Yay, here we go again. These level, <laughs> these last two levels are kind of slow because there's a lot of waiting. Hey, we got a feather. I'm happy. The feathers kind of slow you down if you're holding the jump button because you got that slow floaty thing. So uh, lay off the A button on your way down, and you'll have more speed. Yeah, the uh, these um, uh, dry bones throw bones, I guess. <laughs> The other ones in other castles don't throw bones, but I guess these do. Alright. Death run and go! Okay. So those uh, spikes can indeed squish you. And we don't want to be squished now, do we? And that is not something that I wanted to do when I w woke up today. <laughs> yeah! Here we go again. You know, I, I really don't care about the potaboos as much. Oh my god. Same one! Come on, man. Same one twice. <sighs> and. Yeah, not much progress. <laughs> Let's try this all over again. I'm just gonna run past these, because they're slow enough that I can get the feather again. Yeah, I'm, I'm badly timing that one. That, or maybe it's just that well-timed, or I mean, it's just designed to be that well-timed. And... Uh, yeah, going on... <laughs> I guess they randomly start getting faster at that point. Now I'm just rushing things. <sighs> okay. Take your time, PK Gam. There is no need to rush. Actually, there is. I'm kind of low on camera, so maybe when I get back uh, to this part, I'll be further ahead, or maybe I'll start the other part. Or the part that I said that I wanted to do, uh, that I keep getting squished at. Oh boy, I forgot about that. Once again, I'm just playing like a absolute master of this game, aren't I? <laughs> And mushroom, happy days. Even though it's not gonna matter if I get squished. <laughs> and potaboo.